little all havoc here. So, uh, yeah, last episode we were getting stuff queued up to get our little fighter ship uh, finished up. Uh, I've gotten a ton of shields. Oh, hey, look, they're done. Um, should probably maybe not have so many being built then. Let's take a look. Um, let's see, production, production. Nope, stop. Okay, we have an extra. All right, so in our last episode, we had a comment from Zombie Coffee. Thanks, dude. Uh, our person, don't know if you're a dude, but hey, dude, chick, person, zombie. You're a zombie. Let's not be gender specific. So, uh, Zombie Coffee commented, why? Why? Are you not just queuing up a ton of these things? Well, because I, 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 I didn't think about it. So, um, basically what we can do is disassemble and queue up a couple thousand of these and it'll automatically pull into the queue. Um, how many ever? Um, yeah, it's just going to continue to disassemble them. We're not using them and there are a ton of resources in said missiles. So, that's a, uh, a permanent solution to disassembling them. I like it. And, um, you know what? Um, flag spike. Thank you. Why? I, 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 honestly, I can't wait to get this fixed. Um, so, uh, in the last two videos, I've had a poll going. Um, not a poll, but a survey, I guess. Somewhat the same thing. Um, what would you guys like to see me playing besides Space Engineers? And you need still play to support that there. Um, let's see. This to this. Let's go to some basic inventory stuff, please. And thank you. All right. Um, so that's a legit question. Um, I'm actually really. I just I put steel plates someplace else. Didn't I? Yep, I did. All right, that's better. Uh, so we're gonna do that. So uh, yeah, the poll, the, the question, needing answered, still is available. Uh, I'm saying it at the beginning of this video because normally I say this kind of stuff for the end of the video, but not everybody watches every, the end of every video. YouTube analytics, they prove me right. Trust me. Um, let's see. Let's go there. All right. So, zombie coffee. Check this out. You're a genius. So we're to put this here. Right? Right? Uh, assembler three, or 11 is now going to be called Shipyard Grinder. Uh-huh. Yeah, you see what I'm doing here? Do you? Do you? So we come here, Shipyard Grinder. Go to Disassemble. Well, that's 200 of them. That should still uh, suffice. Uh, so now we'll pull in all of the basic stuff and disassemble those. So production. I'll do this. Uh, um, I'll, I'll take care of this. Uh, but yeah, this will take care of that problem as well. Um, a filter would probably be just as, as effective. But uh, so yeah, this has got to go. <clears throat> We've got, uh, why is my game volume, like, non-existent? Audio. It's, like, not there. Um. There it is. All right. So my mixer was uh, all wonky. I don't know why. So for paint. Uh, okay. So I went and got the uh, cockpit I want to use. And I also, storm uh, while I was on this theme workshop browsing around, I also came across uh, some more uh, stuff from JD Horse, the guy who got us the created the he didn't get us wrong way havoc uh, the guy who created the Titan 
this guy. Uh, great builder. I really like what he his style. And so I basically subbed to his channel, followed his uh, Steam Workshop, and then subsequent, subsequently clicked on his entire collection. Just throw that out there. Uh, so there can be, or there not can be, there will be more things coming down the pipeline from him in our channel on our building some stuff. Uh, let's see. Uh, we want to look at... This is the guy I think I want to use. It's called the Rover Cockpit. And the reason is because it's meant to be sh uh, used in this orientation when you have interior plates. Um, let's see here. Thank you. All right. Um, so we need to pipe it in. So let's go to pipes. Where are you pipes? There we go. Uh, we want to go with... I think we want number six. Like this. That was instant build. And then probably just number two. Uh, oh. Um, lag spike. And included in this conversation um i think so i got a couple days coming off here really soon i what i want to do is um i want to go through my entire mod library which is extensive and uh eliminate a lot of them so this goes like that did we get the connections right we did Oh, all right. So, boom. So this is the orientation it sits. I th think though. Wait, wait. I saw a red strike drone. Is it one solitary strike drone? No, it is not. Uh, so we're gonna come over here. Um, let's say how much time we got. We got a little bit of time. Uh, we have shields now on the ship, so we're just gonna. Ah, shields. Havoc forgot again. I need to put a post-it on my monitor and be like, Havoc, you're a dork. Uh, where are we going, bod? Whoa, there is a lot of them. Quick, get inside, Havoc. Go, go, go. And, boom. Oh, inventory. Control panel. Shield. Custom button. Control copy. Alright. Whoa. That was... That was a lot of effort. I was actually... Pitching VOD up as that missile hit, it actually rolled the nose back down. Like, ooh, like that. Those missile hits can uh, be kind of brutal. Missile hits coming in. Roll, roll. Ugh. Ugh. More incoming. That's pretty cool. All right. I mean, it's cool, but not cool all at the same time. Whoa! That... <laughs> um... <laughs> Duck Havoc! <laughs> all right. So, what... Oh, that was... Look, I think that was a gyro. All right, so let's get in here. This is the cockpit that's going to stay, so we can utilize the cockpit now. I don't actually I'm not sure that's where it's gonna stay at though. I think we need to drop it one more block. No, nah, this will be fine. Because we're going to put we're gonna slope down the nose. Let's go to info, control panel, custom data. Let's put that in there just so we have it. And then we're gonna come in here and paste there. And where is there? Three hundred thousand shield. Fantastic. 
All right, so now we're going to slope from this point back. So now we have a uh, an indicator of what... Okay, so oh, actually, you know what I don't like about this? Is we can't actually get into it from inside the ship. Can we get into it from here? Is that an access port? It is not. Can we get in from the back? There is a door on the back, isn't there? Yep, okay. So we do need to move it. Um, so we're going to put it... Uh, let's go back to number four block. Yeah, we're going to put it... So let's come up. Like that. And then we're going to have to do some connecting shenanigans to bring it in line with oh I, I know what we're doing watch let's try this number two all right do these sit yes they do all right so you're gonna go like this like this <clears throat> I take a drink as our favorite game it continues All right, and oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, like that. Nope, we need this again. We go this early, and then we'll use a number six. There we go. And Havoc cannot build in a straight line. Can you be believe this? A game of squares. And I cannot build in a straight line. Alright, so back to number six. Boom. And why did I, I can't build in a straight line? Oh, I built it in an odd. So number one, four, place a block. Okay. Um, so back to page seven. That goes down. There we go. All right, so we'll move the cockpit down to here. And redo this so let's go with four paint the color back to paint the other color and number nine. Oh, come on havoc you knew this was a thing i did i really did know that that was actually going to do that all right let's do that Do we get it right? I was expecting to be off a block, actually. Uh, let's see. We don't need these anymore, so let's go ahead and get rid of them. All right, so this will be... So now, this is where the cockpit's going to be, and we're going to do some tapering of blocks to get this to all come into <coughs> the correct line that we're working with so probably something like this I'm thinking it would work pretty darn well after this I think we're gonna use this block first come down to the hard block of whoops though like so and then we'll use the number six block like that I think that's gonna work um, we're gonna do some more um,
contouring on the bottom. I really do not like how flat it is. Uh, this ship has a lot of shape going for it, and that just doesn't work for me. So we're going to have to do some uh, bump outs. I'm thinking of something along the lines of like this, but that seems drastic, so I'm not sure. So maybe just this. We'll do some blast door bump outs, and then maybe put like a landing gears in the middle. Although they haven't been working, but that doesn't mean they just can't be there. So, um, all right, so let's take it for a flight. Let's give her a spin. We definitely need more gyros. I mean, that's that's definitely a thing. It stops on a dime. That is really nice. I really like that it does that. Look how fast that stops. Oh, I love it. Look how quick it stops. I mean, we're just doing 14.5. It looks like we're sitting still. <clears throat> yeah, that just happened. Okay, so... We are owning this. This is definitely a thing. Um, we are definitely... Let's, there we go. Body's last loan location. Um, all right. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get rid of that. I have no idea why that's out there. <laughs> I have not died recently, so. Um, oh, let's check this out. Let's see if uh, it fit in the collar fine. So let's see. I'll try to guide it in normal. Nope, a little high. <laughs> oh, 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 vision. Roll back. Okay, new slide. Of the oh man, it is. It is a snug fit. Very snug fit. All right, so we might need to do some modifications to Titan, or uh, we would just might need to put this guy on a diet. Yeah, I think those going will help. Those guys right there. <laughs> just scuff the paint a little. It'll buff out. All right. Uh, power. We are excessive on power. Love it. Uh, let's take a look. We have our jump drives are in. They are obviously charged because we're not using any power right now. Jump drives. we got to rename all of this stuff. We could jump. Uh, wow. That is really far. That is very far. panel let's look at that one more time hopefully the screen's a little bit less obscured uh, 12.5 kilometers that's 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 a decent sized jump for a ship this size um, I'm I'm quite content with that did I say contempt or content either way I like it so, uh, yeah, the ship's coming along really good. Now we just basically got to throw some gyros in it and um, start skinning it up. Uh, I've, again, I'm super satisfied. Better word. One to one. Uh, one to 
definition there. Super satisfied with the uh, performance as far as maneuvering. Um, well, oh, I was just about to say it fits in the collar great as we smack the sides. Ah, uh, come on, get the wrong. Uh, what be? All right. There we go. Sweet. All right. Well, we've come a long way. This craft is definitely going to be uh, a weapon. It's, it's going to be pretty awesome. We just need to start tucking in some gyros into a whole bunch of random locations. And, oh, we should put a, uh, a grav, grav unit on here, too. So, oh, hey, here's a great spot for gyros all along right there. Like it. Maybe two rows. Uh, let's turn on some lights. There we go. So we got to put some blocks in here. Got to shape this up so we can get to the cockpit cleanly. Um, let's take those out. There we go. So we can get into the cockpit from inside the craft. That's great. Um, it's not going to be airtight. I know it's not. Small blocks are not intended to be airtight, but that's fine. This isn't. The, we're just doing this for the shenanigans of, that it is. Uh, when we're done, we're going to paint it up to match the color scheme of the Titan and the collar with the gray and the red and the black. So, <clears throat> yeah, that'll be a that'll be a thing. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. Please subscribe if you're not. I'm knocking on 500. I'm going to be super stoked once we do hit 500 subscribers. And, uh, yeah, comment below. I mean, you guys make comments. I comment back. I even bring your names up sometimes in the videos. So, Thanks again for watching. This is Havoc. Have fun and keep gaming.